Hey, boys and girls, let's get cooking. Remember, I told you we were gonna do haystacks because we read the book Sticks by Jessica Albert. So let's get started. All right, and look what I did. I wrote our ingredients on popsicle sticks. Just something fun. I will post the ingredients at the bottom of the page because I know that you will not be able to see this. The first thing we need is butterscotch morsels. And for that part, you will need two cups, all right? You'll need your two cups of butterscotch morsels. So, to be quick on time, I already measured those out in my measuring cup right here. And I poured two cups. The next thing you need is creamy peanut butter, all right? So what you're gonna do with that is you need three fourths cup. Huh, how much is that? Is that a cup? Is that more than one cup? Well, get out your measuring cup and you will look. It is a little less than one cup. So fill up three fourths cup, put it in your bowl, then you need to put your bowl in the microwave. And if you need help, get somebody to help you. And you are going to cook it for a few minutes and then give it a stir. Look at there. That looks like it melted like the popsicle did in the book, doesn't it? Yeah, I wanna get it nice and melted. And I'm stirring it up, okay? And the next thing you need is your um, chow mein noodles. See, have you seen these anywhere before? Have you ever eaten them? So you need 10 ounces of this. How much is 10 ounces? I don't know. Well, look, let me tell you. Look on the bag and you will see how many ounces are in your bag. For most bags, it's 12 ounces. So. Do I have enough? Well, let's see. It says 10. 10 is less than 12, so I've got the perfect amount. I'll have a little left over. Or if you want a little extra, just dump them all in, okay? So let's get going. Let me open my bag. I should have gotten some scissors. Let me open my bag, and we're gonna pour them right in there. And I like to, in between, give a little stir. This is gonna be messy, okay? We're gonna stir them in and try to make sure everything is getting covered. And you see, I still have a lot of melt, a lot of butterscotch and peanut butter, okay? So I need to add more, because remember it said um, 10 ounces so I know that's just about my whole bag. All right, so we're gonna give it a mix. And we're using this because it was kind of like the sticks, right? Kind of like our sticks in our book today that was so good. I'm so glad y'all were able to participate with me today. It was good to see your friends, right? So we're getting it mixed up. And if you want to, you don't have to use a spoon at all. You know what you can do? Get in there with your hands and mix it up and feel it. Make sure it's not too hot though, okay? Before you start. All right, now, I think I've got a little bit of candy melt on every single piece. What do y'all think? Sure does smell good. Okay, so here we go. Now, I have a little container here and you can have wax paper down if you think you might need it. Let me move these measuring cups so we can see. And I'm just gonna scoop a little bit out and lay it down. And when they dry, you're gonna need to leave them for a few hours so they'll take form and they'll harden. 
And when you drop them, you know what they kind of look like? A little bird nest, okay? So I'm gonna keep dropping those and make a few. And remember, it's always fun to try something new, right? So these are called haystacks and they go along with our book, The Bird's Nest, I mean, sticks, right? So I hope you enjoy them. I hope you will give this a try and y'all have a good day. Bye.